dear students, how are you today? I hope you are feeling good and ready to start our lesson. Our theme is musical instruments. Ребята, наша тема на сегодня – музыкальные инструменты. Today we will revise irregular verbs, learn new words and read a text. Сегодня мы с вами повторим неправедные глаголы, выучим новые слова, а также прочитаем текст. First, let's make a quick revision. Write the past simple forms of the verbs. Come, go, see, do, write, buy, take and read. You have some time to do this task. I hope you are ready. Let's check together. Come, came, go, went, see, saw, do, did, write, wrote, buy, bought, take, took, and read, read. Well done. Students, pay attention that the spelling of the word read is the same, but we pronounce in the past simple as Read. Обратите внимание, что read в прошедшем времени читается как read. Есть специальная таблица неправильных глаголов. Вам нужно ее выучить. Please ask and answer. Let's look at the example first. You go to cinema Saturday. Let's make up a question. Did you go to the cinema on Saturday? Yes, I did or no, I didn't. Now it is your turn. Make up the sentence, please, and answer. Let's check. Did your dad read a book last week? Yes, he did or no, he didn't. Look at this. Make up a sentence and answer. Great. Did you buy a DVD last month? Yes, I did or no, I didn't. Make up a question, please. Let's check. Did they go to the park last week? Yes, they did. Or no, they didn't. Well done. Girls and boys, let's learn new words. Listen and repeat. A piano. A piano. Pianino. A harp. A harp. Arfa. Drums. Drums, барабаны, an accordion, an accordion, баян, an acoustic guitar, an acoustic guitar, акустическая гитара, a violin, a violin, скрипка, a cello, a cello, violoncello. An electric guitar. An electric guitar. Electro guitar. A bass guitar. A bass guitar. Bass guitar. A saxophone. A saxophone. Saxophone. A synthesizer. A synthesizer. Synthesizer. Keep in mind. Let's practice. Girls and boys, read and match the musical instruments with music types. What musical instruments do we use to play these music types? Take your time, please.
Let's check. We use electric guitar in rock. We use saxophone in jazz. We use harp in classical music. We play accordion in ethnic. We use violin in folk. We use drum in heavy metal. We play synthesizer in disco. And we also can play synthesizer in pop. Excellent! Girls and boys, now we are going to do listening task. Please listen and match the name of the students and the musical instruments. Let's read the names first. Maggie, Leslie, David, Simon, Laura, Anne. And musical instruments. Electric guitar, drums, flute, accordion, violin, synthesizer and bass guitar. Now we are ready to listen. Hi, Marianne. Where were you? I was listening to Maggie's band play. Wow! Maggie has got a band? Yes. Some others from our class are in the band too. It was their first concert. Really? What kind of music do they play? Rock. Maggie plays the electric guitar. Cool! She's lucky. What about the others? Well, there is Leslie. She's crazy about electronic instruments, so she plays the synthesizer. Does David play in the band too? Yes. At first he was the singer, but now he plays the drums too. Wow! That's difficult. Yes, but he's a better drummer than Simon. Now Simon plays the bass guitar. Of course, you know Laura can play lots of instruments. She plays the violin in the band. What about her friend, Anne? They're always together. Is she in the band too? Yes, she is. She plays the flute. So, how was the concert? It was amazing. Great. Let's check. Maggie plays electric guitar. Leslie plays synthesizer. David plays drums. Simon can play bass guitar. Laura can play the violin. And Anne plays the flute. Great job! Students, please note, in Kazakhstan the most popular musical instruments are kobas, jetegen and dombara. Can you think of more? Well done! Girls and boys, instead of using the same word over and over again, we can use synonyms. For example, tasty, delicious, nice, amazing, bad, terrible, good, great, and bad, disappointing. Be attentive. We use synonyms according to the meaning of the sentences. Now, let's practice. Replace the adjectives in bold with adjectives from the list. You should use delicious, amazing, terrible, great, disappointing. Take your time, please. Time is up. I hope you are ready. Let's check. It was a terrible concert. We had a great time. The food was delicious. The music was amazing. The performance was disappointing. Wonderful! Students, let's read the text about Dombra. Please follow and be ready to do the task. The Dombra is a long-necked musical string instrument. The Dombra is a very popular instrument in Kazakhstan. The melodies of the traditional Dombra strike a chord with Kazakhs in a way that's hard for non-Kazakhs to understand, evoking memories of ancestors, family and patriotism. One of the greatest Dombra players was the Kazakh folk musician and composer Kroman Ghazel who had a great influence on the development of Kazakh musical culture, including music for the Dombra. 
His musical composition Adai is popular in Kazakhstan and abroad. Well, let's proceed to the task. Make the sentences true or false. Let's read the first sentence. One of the greatest Dombra players was Kurman Razev. Is it true or false? Awesome! The sentence is true. The Dombra is a woodwind musical instrument. True or false? Very good! The answer is false, because it is a string instrument. The Dombra isn't a very popular instrument in Kazakhstan. Very good! The answer is false. It is very popular. Musical composition Adai was composed by Kurman Ghazem. Is this sentence true or false? Good. The answer is true. Well done. Students, today we have revised the irregular verbs, learned the new words, and we have read the text. The lesson is over. Thank you and goodbye.